Hey everyone, hey thanks for letting me take a couple minutes to, to just kind of drop in. Let me ask you a question. When you're out and about, maybe you're doing grocery shopping or you have to run to the store to pick something up, how many times um, do you see a shield in front of the person helping you check out? I mean, everywhere. so you come to Gateway's office, there's a shield there. Um, it's offering a limited amount, amount of protection and that's what they're designed for. Um, but what about behind that person or beside or maybe from above? What kind of protection is it, is it offering? It's offering limited protection. But I love how David describes the Lord. Listen to Psalm chapter three, verse three. But you, O Lord, are a shield, but then he says this, around me. You are my glory, the one who holds my head high. So here's what he's saying. You're just not got a shield in front of me or behind me or beside me. You're a shield around me. Think of a soldier carrying a shield, offered pretty good protection in front of him, you know, stop the arrows from coming in and so on. But what about behind him? I don't think so good. That's why I love the way David describes the Lord. Not just a shield in front, not just a shield on the side or in the back, but you are a shield around me. He goes on in verse number four, I cried out to the Lord and he answered me from his holy mountain. I lay down and slept, yet I woke up in safety for the Lord was watching over me. So when you're out and about and you see a shield that's there to offer limited protection, let that be a reminder to you and to me that God is our shield. He's your shield. He's my shield. And he offers protection all around us. I'm praying for you this week. Hope you have a great week and we're going to have a great day worshiping together this Sunday.